Busy Bird, welcome back to Sonic Colors Ultimate. In the last episode, we made our way through Planet Wisp, saved as many wisps as we could, and of course, if we did get another generator. Now we're moving to the next area, the Aquarium Park, which looks like a lot of fun. I mean, I know that underwater levels have a bad rap in Sonic games for being super stressful and super scary, but look at this. It's even sort of samurai ninja themed. So this could be a lot of fun. So yeah, of course we have a lot of levels to get through. I guess are just normal six acts in a boss fight. So let's go ahead and get started with the first act here in Aquarium Park. The game is getting a lot more difficult, so we'll see how things go with this one. But I'm sure it'll be fine. Don't know what this sort of red, it almost looks like an apparatus of some sort around the, the planet is. Oh boy. Whoa, see we're under the water right now in some tubes and stuff. I can dodge around a little bit if I need to. There we go. Okay, can I get through those rings? There we go, that was cool. Oh wow, and I got into the grind rail. Oh my gosh, I'm going so fast right now. But hey, we're getting a ton of collectible coins for that. That's nice. Oh, and there was even more I could have gotten there, but I didn't jump in time. Oh yeah, right up that way. Uh, well, this wasn't what I was expecting. I thought I could go up with this. I don't know where I am. What's happening? I missed a red coin, but there is another one. Oh no, there it is again. So I must have bounced backwards. I don't know what happened there. That was bizarre. Anyways, it's fine. Oh, we got something. Okay, I didn't mean to cancel that, but I guess we can push this box. Whoa, that's new. So good to keep that in mind. And we're going under the water. We know how this works in Sonic games. We gotta be really careful to manage how much air we have. Even you can't get it underwater, so you'll have to get to the surface. But bubbles like that are a way to grab some air while you're down there. Okay, sounds good. So I don't think I need it too much as long as I can yeah, just slam under the button and boost, you can run across the water without falling in. Nice. So let's see that here. Just run across the water super fast. That's cool. And yet another one of these. It wants me to, oh, yeah, slide under here. That makes sense. Oh gosh, Eggman's using water puns. So there has to be a way up there, but unfortunately, it doesn't seem like I have the laser. Huh, and I could have maybe hopped down that way. Okay, not worth worrying about for right now. We're just going to push that thing over. Got the crab robots. Oh, here's the laser. So we could backtrack if we wanted to. I'm not gonna sweat it too much. Well, we're way up here. I don't even know where I am right now. Oh, now we have the drill. How would the drill work underwater, I wonder? Guess we could try to find out. Actually, quite nice. Can I go into the ground? Not really, but who needs it? And now we're back underwater again. Okay, try to be careful. Right, these guys are huge. I'm just trying to avoid them. Oh, there we go. Kick that over, I guess. Don't know what that really did for me. Oh, but maybe I could kick it over that way. Here are some of these enemies as well. I feel like it'd just be just as easy to do this. I don't really see too much of a point in kicking the box over. I guess when there gets to be this many of them, I could see the benefit but it's definitely a little bit weird. When there's a button over here. Let's make sure I press that then. And it unlocked more laser stuff, but I still don't have the laser ability, so it doesn't change much. We're just gonna move forward. Whoa. Okay. Get rid of all these guys. No problem. So, so far this is a really cool area and I can hear ourselves Coming up on the end. Let's just draw our way over. And I probably missed a couple of collectibles there. I only got one red rank. But maybe a better than a C? You only gotta be rank. Honestly, I think that's my general goal right now is to just surpass B rank. If I can do that, I'm pretty happy. Okay, so with that out of the way, our first act, a B rank no less, we're good to move to the next area where I'm sure there'll be even more stressful underwater action. So I haven't played too many of the Sonic 2D games, but of course the original Sonic had some pretty stressful underwater parts. 
but I did play the very original Sonic when I was younger. And a little bit of Sonic 2, but I don't remember if that one had any underwater parts, to be honest with you. Whoa, hold on. So let's get back up here, if I can, so I can get that. And it looks like I could switch to cube, slam like that, grab that red coin, but then we gotta move. I don't know where. Oh, there's another one. Okay, that was good. And there's an extra coin for us as well. So pretty good start to that. There's a never ending pit below us once again. It's very stressful. Okay, cube. I don't know if that was the best idea at that angle. <laughs> it wasn't. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, yeah, I know. We got this this time. No, what was that? It had the, it gave you the option to speed boost on him or to, you know, homing attack. And then it just didn't work. That was weird. All right, so I wanna jump over this. No, it's not gonna work again. Oh, that's so weird. That's not what I wanted at all. Sometimes the game's, the game's controls are a little awkward. But like I've said before, I feel like that's always been my issue with Sonic games, is that sometimes Sonic just like won't do what I'm trying to get him to do, that I don't have the same issue with when I play Mario or Kirby or some other 2D platformer, or 3D platformer, just platformers in general. Okay, so we're gonna use the cube there, so I can get through this. I don't think I was supposed to do that there. Um. Oh no, there we go, land on this platform. I hear the end of the level. Sonic, you're kidding me. <laughs> what are you doing, buddy? Okay, all I wanna do here is get the red ring. See, it was asked too difficult. Now we just gotta jump across this platform. I hear the end of the level and we get another one. I almost got all five of them. Actually, that was the fourth one. So maybe the fifth one isn't too far away. I wanted to jump over that or, oh, I don't even need to. So what does this button do? I guess it just made this over here. Weird, I don't know where the fifth one is, but at least we got a good chunk of them. What an odd level. What is my score for this gonna be? It's gonna be a D rank. That's actually my lowest rank yet, I think. So that didn't turn out well, even though we got four red coins. Some things just didn't go the way I wanted it to there, which is fine. We can always replay the level, get a little better on it. For right now though, we're moving over that way. That was not the path I was expecting. So let's give it a try. Act three coming in. Hopefully it goes a little bit better. But it really goes to show the game is getting a whole lot more difficult. Our Sonic skills are gonna have to be super sharp if we wanna get through. I mean, maybe I just go down? I'm not really sure what the, the goal is here. You just gotta be careful because we move very slow under the water as you can see. I don't wanna run out of air. So maybe for now it'll be better just to go to the bottom, grab some extra air, and then we can move. Oh, get the rocket, for sure. Hold on. Yeah, let's use the rocket. Go, 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 go. And we're back to the surface, please. Whoa, I am way up here, oh my goodness. Okay, I can't really see what we're going down on from this angle. This seems fine to me. Okay, watch out for the spikes. And I got it. There's our first red coin. So, going under that really fast. Still don't have any speed boost here, so. I've definitely heard this music before though. I think this is one of the more popular songs in the game. It's a nice one. It's exciting and relaxing at the same time. Whoa. Can I make it up there? I just barely can. Whoa, wait, what was that? Was that another rocket? It is another rocket over what looks like a Super Mario pipe. Where should I use this though? I guess right here, this trail of coins or rings is looking peculiar. Oh, definitely worth it. If I can get into here without getting damaged. Okay, so far so good. All right, just be careful. That was not careful. Well, all right, well, I got impatient. <laughs> Silly me. Even in a Sonic game, not always worth rushing things. Still don't know what the purple wisp is. I don't know if we got that in this area or not. 
There are rings everywhere. Hmm. Okay, can you guys watch it? I can't bust through that, but I guess the purple wisp would be able to. Hmm. Not gonna sweat it too much. Just focused on moving forward. There we go. And there's the end of the level. Got it. So I think that's also gonna be not a very high ranking. I say that, but we're starting at C rank. We get the B. What is weird is why was that one a B rank, but the other one was a D rank? I feel like we got through that one much faster. Either way, doesn't matter. It's in our past now. And a Sonic is pretty important just to look forward. But yeah, we're definitely not getting the Purple Wisp in today's episode. I don't see it anywhere. So that'll have to wait until next episode, I'm sure. But for right now, we have Act 4 in Aquarium Park. So far, Aquarium Park is really cool, but really challenging. Whoa, look at this. It's like a giant octopus tentacle. Oh my gosh, what is that? I don't know, but it's chasing me and I don't like it. Ah, that was close. All right, let's get out of here before he catches up to us. Oh, I see what I gotta do here. I need to... Come on, there we go. Push this thing. Just like that. There you go. Run across the water there. And I don't have the laser ability, so not much I can do there. But I could grab some extra air. This is a giant shark robot. I can't homing dive on him, so that was maybe a bad idea. Can I go to this pipe? Uh, maybe? It has little arrows in it. No, that's so weird. Sort of looks like I could go through there, but I can't. Either way, we're not gonna worry about it. Instead, we'll use drill. Oh, the drill can go through them. Nice. All right, grab some more drills then. So the drill is definitely the go-to swimming. Move. What's below here though? Uh, more drill, that's good. Just knock everybody out then. Just trying to see if there's anything extra to grab around here, but I guess not. Oh, these refresh, so that's nice. So we could really just do this for as long as we want with how many are down here. Get rid of you guys, see ya. Go through the pipe again, and now we're back out of the water. Was that a good idea? I guess so. Ow! That was not a good idea, though. Hmm. Yeah, jump over that. We can sort of swim infinitely, so that's good. I didn't realize we could do that. So we've got another drill, and you know what we're doing. We're drilling over this way. Grab that one. Uh, yeah, go through the pipe, I guess. Got it. So what's down here? I can drill through those, it just takes a second. Oh, got the ring, got the coin. See, that was a coin, <laughs> I called that one a ring. Ow, why did that hurt me? All the other times I've done that, it hurt him. Oh, now we got laser, which I guess we'll use here once we're out of the water. Where can I use it though, I wonder? Can't click it up there. Hmm. Wait, do I just hear Eggman on the intercom talking in a pirate voice because you know we're in an underwater area? When he just got mad at that other guy for doing that? Oh, here we go. So we can go through those boxes with that laser. Yeah, he was just complaining about the pirate voice a few episodes ago when his one robot friend did it. And then I just heard him on the intercom talking in a pirate voice. I mean, I guess he's a bad guy, so it's in his nature to be hypocritical, but come on. Oh gosh, whoa, dodge, or just run. He's really trying to catch up to us right now. Not on my watch. Whoa. We are out of here. Remember, if we quick step a lot, we do get bonus points for it, so might as well just do that, earn some easy points. This guy is still hot on our trail, though. Whoa, okay, that was not the way to dodge. I am, oh, come on, was I supposed to jump there? I guess? That was sort of weird. Now I gotta do the whole thing over. Let's just boost away for now. I guess? Yeah, I can't. That's so weird. Which way do I dodge? I don't understand. That's bizarre. I tried to jump. It doesn't let you jump in that section. So maybe I need to save my speed boost for when he tries to punch us, but I don't know. 
Oh, the laser got me this time. Okay, go, 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 go. I think I just have to be away from him when he does that. He's gonna do that, and we're fine. Okay, I think we're fine, but maybe not. Yeah, I can't jump. I can't jump out of the way of that, so that's not the thing I do there. I don't know what you do to dodge at. Because no matter what side I'm on, that's so weird. What do you do there? <laughs> it's just not gonna tell me. I don't understand. Okay, I'm saving that speed boost until he starts throwing those punches on. Yeah, I think literally the only thing you can do there, ow, come on, that was silly, is speed boost away, but look at that, I'm already out of speed boost again. That is so ridiculous. I don't like how that works, gotta be honest. So you just gotta be very sparing with your speed boost. Only use it when he's about to punch you. That is so odd. Okay, keep running. This is where he catches up a little bit. Ah, oh. and now I'm, um, guess what? I'm out of speed boost again. Even when I was using it super sparingly there, it, it was still not enough. That is so weird. Why did they make it that way, I wonder? Cause like, it just seems odd. Because no matter which way I go, I can't dodge a punch. I've tried to move towards it, tried to move away from it. I'm just gonna try to use the tiniest amount of it. And only when he's super close, I guess that was close enough. Darn. I don't know why they made this part so difficult. Okay, so I have some rings right now, and I would like to keep it that way. And I'm out of speed boost, so this is where it gets really difficult. I got some rings right at the last moment and I think I dodged it. Oh my gosh, that was insane. But there we go. We broke one of these things again, unleashing a bunch of wisps. Very cool. Wow, that last part was one of the most difficult parts yet. The game is getting super challenging, but we did what we could. So with that done, I think there's what, two more acts left? And there's more of this. I guess we got enough red coins, we got 50 of them to do something there. Okay, so yeah, with that done, we have another act over that way to tackle. Let's go for it. So act five, hopefully not any more difficult than act four, but I guess we're about to find out. Going up here for now, whoa, we're way up here. So maybe there'll be less underwater sections for this one. We got this bouncing thing again, which, could be really bad news if I accidentally press the wrong button. No worries, Sonic. Okay. If Tails tells me not to worry, then I'm not gonna worry. I trust him. We are out of uh, Tails' help now. We're at zero, so gotta be careful of that. Oh, here's another one. I think I need to explode this. Oh, I think it's too late. Oh, that's unfortunate, so I don't get that. But I can at the least get that and keep going. And get these rings pretty easily. Oh, be fast with this. I just barely grazed that, but that was enough. For it to not be good enough. Come on, can I get this one? There you go. And a checkpoint I'll gladly get. And we're back to this. So this could end up, whoa! It like almost didn't catch up with me though, that was scary. What do I do here? I think I need to Ah, uh, not that, that's for sure. Okay, why well, miss one? Not the end of the world. There's another one over this way, and then I can just get through these rainbow rings. Still not too bad. There we go. I'll grab that real fast, and then we're moving. We have a whole set of them now. I do think yeah, in the distance, I can hear at the end of the level coming up. Let's charge those guys. Oh, here's another one. Maybe this will make a chain explosion. It does, so that's enough for me to get another one. Very good. Grab some extra rings, because I definitely need them. We're so close to the end here. Something's firing at us, and I don't like it. Oh no, here comes more of it. Just trying to dodge. Ready, go for it! No, wait! Oh, come on. Get out of here with that. Right at the end, so we won't have any rings, so that's definitely gonna affect our score. 
But come on, it was still a good time. So it looks like we are getting a B rank. All right, well, I'll take what I can get. B rank is certainly a lot better than some of the other rankings we've been getting a lot recently. So there we go. At least it was a quicker level as well. So that's nice. So let's see what our last act is before the boss fight. Hopefully something good. Act six of Aquarium Park. But that last level, Act five was definitely a lot more my pace. I enjoyed that one. Let's see what we got in this one. Oh gosh, back under the water. Not sure if I'm super happy about that, but we gotta go. Oh, the, the, the school of fish is chasing us around. That's so cute. Uh, Sort of running out of air here. Yeah, let's wait right here for just a moment. <laughs> That's so cute. I don't need all the ranks, but maybe just enough that I can survive if anything bad happens. Oh, that sent me all the way back down. Oh, here we go. So how do we, we can activate the ghost and then just go over, grab the coins, grab this. Now I'm over this way. The ghost one definitely has one of the coolest sound effects or like theme song to it. Okay, I guess we're good just to keep going this way. Everything's so quiet down here. And that's so weird because it's, it's such a game that has loud, ecstatic music. That's weird when the game is really quiet like this. So I don't have the drill, so I can't go through the pipe just yet. We can go this way. Oh, five seconds. Got it, we're fine. And I went through those. I'm definitely missing a lot of stuff, but I just don't know how to get to it. This seems good for now though. <laughs> Even if I don't get much out of it, it's something. Oh, and there's another ghost. Oh wait, how do I get to it though? I don't know. Almost got under, but it just doesn't really let me. That's so weird. Maybe I need a speed boost. So once again, I'm getting next to nothing here. Oh no. Well, at least one thing I can't, some extra air. There we go. Where are we going next? <laughs> not that way. It just knocked me right back down. Come on, keep going, keep going. Oh. At least get this, right? <laughs> get something. Oh, finally, some speed boosts. But I can only imagine we're close to the end of the level at this point, you know? Or maybe not. Charging right through all this. This part of the level is always so pretty. These surface areas. There we go. Let's try to, yeah, charge some of those guys. Whoa, that was a little weird. Look, I went through a wall there. Oh, we got one of the green guys. Still one of my favorite ones. Cause he just sort of let it go. Oh, please don't attack me. I really didn't get too much done now. Hmm, I was expecting more from that. There we go, oh gosh. No, 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 no! I didn't see the pit until it was too late. And now I have no speed boost. What? That was weird. Okay. Gotta build up some speed and then yeah, dash across, I guess. Oh, can I, yeah, there we go. Do some tricks, get a pretty easy red coin. Speaking of which, there's another one right there, but I don't think I can get that from this angle. Yeah, not looking like it. Which is weird, I guess that means if you get one, you can't get the other. Whoa. There are enemies everywhere. I really need more rings. Really need more rings. How do I get out of this? I think I just have to defeat them all. Gotcha. That's not what I meant, but it works. And that's all of them. We can keep going. Can run across the water there, but it doesn't get me much. Whoa! Oh my gosh, it scared me. Was not expecting the giant evil eel of doom. There we go. Ow. Oh yeah, they're, they're sometimes hard to see, the little robot fish. I'm just trying to get through at this point. This level is definitely a lot longer than the other one. Oh, that is not the surface. I was like, what's going on there? I guess we are currently in an underwater cave, which sort of scares me, because we need air as soon as possible. Three seconds, 
Come on. Or at the end of the level as well. No, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. Can this give me some air? This is not good. No, we we're so close. That's not fair. I just, there was no air bubbles anywhere. Don't know what we could have done there. Okay, well, let's definitely take whatever time. Oh my gosh, we can get here. Go over here. I wanna go down this way this time, see if that's any different. Aha, here we go. So definitely grab that. Extra rings for me, avoid this guy at all costs. There's some extra air. Those guys I definitely wanna avoid. But we know what to do here now. Can grab this real fast, please don't hurt me. Uh. All right, we got it. Phew, what a stressful one day. Okay, so I don't think we'll get much better than a B rank here. Yep, just a B rank. That's fine, we did it. So, with that out of the way, I think we're ready for our boss fight at the Aquarium Park. And with how this level's been, or this world, this area, I'm a little nervous for this one, but I guess we'll find out together how well it goes. Yet another generator. Man, running past all those fish put me in the mood for sushi. I doubt Eggman had the decency to put a good sushi joint in this park. Remember, ladies and gentlemen, try the newest dining experience here at Eggman's incredible interstellar amusement park, the Bucket of Sushi. Ooh. Now with fish. You're good. Ugh, like I was saying. I thought that was the whole point, is that sushi is fish. What in hey, the world? Did somebody here order a clobbering? Got another ship to take on. Are you sure? It says somebody ordered an extra large clobbering topped with everything. <laughs> he looks very indifferent. Okay. Tell you what, I can't take this thing back, so I'll give you an extra large clobbering for nothing. Hope you're hungry. All right, well, that fish robot chip is sort of a tough crowd. Didn't laugh a single time at Sonic's jokes, but you know what? We're laughing. We appreciate your joke, Sonic. Let's go for it. Oh wait, what is this? This guy isn't gonna show himself until you take care of that sub. There's a switch in the back. Break it to stop the sub's function. Okay, so sort of like a couple of bosses ago, we need to take on either the, the, the candy pirates. I don't know what these are. There's little bubbles, oh gosh. Got missiles going for us as well. Drop some air, so we gotta get to the end of this area, and then we can fight the boss, basically. There's the switch. Do we just press on the top or something? That doesn't work. Oh, I see. Okay, so the missile's gotta do it for me. Oh my. Red alert, red alert. The ship is going down. Abandoned ship. Only just starting now that he's shown himself. Don't let him pressure you. Stay cool, then attack. Sounds good. Oh, there, these are all his little sailors. Okay, but where's the mean bad guy? Okay, there he is. He's playing some music. How do I attack him? Oh, I have drill, I have drill. That would certainly help. Uh, can you get back here maybe? Uh, how do I get to him? He is so fast. I missed him. This is so weird. I'm about out of time for this. That was so weird. What do I do to get him? Uh. That doesn't work, I'm out of rings, so. Okay, well that was not a good start. I don't know, that was weird. I tried to hit him, but he was so fast. Okay, for right now, we're not gonna worry about it too much. I'm gonna slam down this way, grab some extra air on my way up. We know what to do for this part, at least. We just, uh, basically we wanna get to the other side of this and let the missiles do their thing. Yep, just like that. They'll come over, I think. They did last time, so. Might have to guide them over though, which would sort of be a pain. Cause I don't see any. Yo, where are they? Awesome, this wasn't a problem. I know, I'm running out of air. I'll be fine. Okay, where are they? Cause clearly this is not working the way it was before. They're so quick though. I don't know if I'll be able to stay away from them in time. Come on, don't get exploded by that, thank you. Please destroy this. There we go, okay. Now quickly switch that before I run out of air. This whole thing comes down just like last time. 
But what a weird fight. So this time, I'm going to, because there seems to be no way I can attack him until, but see, I tried to hit him. There we go. So he's got to chase him upwards like that. That makes sense. And now we're back. Yeah, the ship is raising again. I get it. Yeah, okay, we've already heard that. I don't need to hear it again. So basically, same deal. We need to bring these missiles with us. A little bit difficult to do that for this part, but I think we, ow, oh, maybe we can. i grab a couple of rings. I guess I don't have to worry about it for that section because there is more that show up here. Oh no, 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 wait, wait, wait. Yeah, that's so difficult to actually get them to follow you there. I don't know if any of them are, okay, we have one after us, so that's good. So if I stand back here, I can now just hit that switch and go for him again. So this is definitely a more challenging boss than the previous one so far. So we have the drill ability. What I think we have to do here is wait for him. Don't know where he's gonna be. All right, he's over that way. And then as soon as I sort of see where I can get under him, I think we need to just go straight up on him and miss him, darn. So that's what I don't understand, is if we run out of time here, where can I get more drill? Because I don't see any drill ability anywhere. I try to get right under him and do that, but he just moves so fast. Yeah, I'm very confused. I don't know. Oh, maybe I could just slam on him like that. Okay, he's gonna go. And then, did that work? I think I hit the bu the bubble, which sort of messed me up. These guys are sort of getting in the way now. Where is he? That was silly. That was really silly. Really? Why did that hurt me? I slammed on him. I don't know, that's so weird. Okay, see, that time I was able to hit him. He just, uh... But then that's where it gets weird, as he starts flying around like that, and he's very difficult to keep up with. I sort of just have to hope I bump into him. He moves so fast, it's sort of just hard to deal with, but when he's spinning like that, I can't get him. But then I can get him like that, which is what I thought I did before, but I guess my timing was a bit off. All right, he's up there now, playing his tunes. Got him, okay. So even though I didn't have the drill ability that time, I think I get it from one of the missiles. It was sort of weird. Because I definitely didn't have the drill that time. Didn't mean to hit that. So we have a decent amount of rings. Yeah, I guess, I think those things, see how that one was sort of yellow while the rest of them were red? I think that's how I get the, the thing, but I'm not really sure. It's so weird. Uh, let's grab that. Yeah, and try, you see how this one's yellow? I'm gonna get it just to get destroyed maybe? Or maybe I don't even need to do that if I can just get it to this thing over here. Hopefully that's enough. Nope, I still don't have the drill. Whatever, it's fine. What a weird situation though. Okay, so I'm just gonna wait right here and hopefully he'll charge at me. All the sailor friends around here. So there he is. All right, right about, oh, I missed him. That stinks. Now I don't know where he is. He's apparently above my head right now. Oh, come on. That was ridiculous. Okay, I did get him there. That counted. Oh, I don't even have to, oh, okay. I can just roll into him. I'm pretty sure I tried that already, but I guess not. Got him. There we go, that's gonna knock him away though. So that's nice. Oh wait, is that it? Is that it? I think we got him. He's done. Thank goodness. What a difficult one. Okay, we'll definitely grab all these. All right, boss fight defeated. That one, that was one of the trickier ones so far. I'm not gonna get the best ranking for that. It said I ran out of time. I don't know, if, maybe the timer kept going when I died and had to start over. Who knows, because that is my lowest rank yet. <laughs> okay, with that done though, it's still completed. The generator's destroyed. Hmm. Great 
job, Sonic. You know me. I aim to please. Well, I'm totally pleased. And a little nauseous. I grabbed a bite at the bucket of sushi. What's the verdict? His cruelty knows no bounds. Oh, no. That doesn't sound good. All right. Well, definitely not eating there. Don't want to get uh, seasick. But there we go, the aquarium park is completed. Next episode, we'll be heading into the next area, of course, which is Asteroid Coaster. That sounds like a lot of fun, but for the rest of today's episode, we do have 47 of the customizable coins, so hopefully we can get something at the least. Also, how are we doing towards our progress towards Super Sonic over here? We need to collect red star rings to unlock levels in the Game Land Sonic Simulator, so we haven't really done that yet, but we'll work on it. For right now, though, uh, we'll go to Customize, and we'll see, we have enough for one of these boost effects. So we have fire, floral, ice, light, and dark. Well, for this one, we need win six rival rush races. Huh. I think we'll stick with the fire. The fire looks really cool to me. Let's get this one. I want that. <laughs> so Tails is happy about it. So I guess next up, we'll try to save up for one of the auras. So I'll have to sort of take a look at that at some point. But for right now, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Sonic Colors Ultimate. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.